morning. We just got into the car because we are going to Eliana's doctor's appointment today. She is off of school for Veterans Day. Um, she's been off since Wednesday. She was off Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and today. So she goes back tomorrow. And so we're getting her checkup done today. And I have so many errands to run. I gotta run to the townhouse that I own, pay the association fee, I gotta pay the water bill there. I gotta grab some color from the hair supply store, the doctors today. I gotta finish editing a video that I wanna get up tonight. Today's Monday in filming time. Um, to get that up, so that'll be up for you guys. But it's before this video is up. So lots to do today. I do wanna try to film or vlog a lot today for you guys if I can. Um, but it's mostly just running around, so. Belly. But I do wanna be able to vlog because Eliana is like never in my vlogs because I usually vlog when she's at school and I really want her to kind of be in them more so that you guys can see her too and she can have her spotlight time. So anyway, we're gonna go head to the doctors because we're gonna be late in about two minutes and I will catch up All later. All right, so Ellie did good at her appointment. She didn't have to get a shot, but Ray did. Ray got a flu shot. And she did good, she didn't cry. Nope, then I guess we're gonna go to Target because Ellie wants to spend money, which means that mommy is gonna spend money and mommy doesn't have money. All right, we just got back from all of our errands. I'm eating a Twix bar. Um, we went to, um, let me finish this. Okay. We went to Target because Ellie had $7 she wanted to spend. And I was like not impressed right now with their Christmas section compared to their Christmas section they had last year. And their Halloween section, so I'm just kind of hoping that maybe they're gonna get more as it gets closer to Christmas. And then I went to the dollar store to see their Christmas decorations, and they had like a lot of things that you hang from the walls, like the like plaque looking things, but nothing else really, and a lot of ornaments and stuff. So I didn't get anything from there either, except for I did find Christmas towels because I don't think I got towels last year, so I need to get some this year. So I got two different sets. So I got two of these ones, as you can see here, and then I got a snowman and a uh, Santa Claus so that when one set is in the wash, I can still have the other set out. And um, I always like having one that kind of like is decorative or says something and then one that is like nice and like festive. So if you look like here, it's a little bit different. This one has like a nice little Thanksgiving quote on it and then I just have one that's just like simple and then they kind of just go together. So it's not like too much going on. So that's why I did here and I mean I got all these towels for a total of four dollars. So um, Target had towels but it was one towel and like a hot pad for like five dollars and I was like I can get like I don't really need the hot pad. I'll just get the towels at the dollar store for a dollar a piece and get more. So as, as far as my Christmas decoration shopping goes, this is as far as I've gotten right now. All right, so I'm gonna drink my green magic drink. And you, um, if you had watched other videos or you're on my Instagram, you will know exactly what this is. I had this in my last vlog, I believe, and it is in my mommy morning routine. So go check that out if you want to kind of know how I make it. It doesn't look good. It doesn't taste great, but it's not that bad. All right, so I'm just gonna drink this and I'm gonna edit my morning routine video to get that up for you guys, hopefully by today. Teeth. Ellie did. She lost another tooth. Fishing. Yep. She has a couple teeth growing in, but her mouth is really small, so some of the teeth grew in and like blocked a space that another tooth was supposed to be coming in. And so it's like gonna start coming in behind her teeth. So my child is gonna seriously need braces. Does anybody wanna fund that for me? Look what is on my porch. The best and greatest order in the world. Oh, wait till you see. Wait till you see. But before I show you what is in that package, I'm gonna show you a Target haul of grocery and 
some Christmas decor. Okay, so I'm gonna start with the non-refrigerated side here because this is the most, this is the bulk of it. I'm gonna do this quickly because I don't want this vlog to be like an hour long. So this is all from Target. Um, I got two Fit Kitchen bowls. I had 25% off coupon. I am eating very healthy right now and I've been sticking to it. It's been about a week and a half now. And I felt amazing, you know, I have been a yo-yo dieter in the past and this time like I feel fully committed and I'm like on board with what to eat. I've been doing a lot of research with other YouTubers who I've like fallen in love with watching their fit videos. So these have 22 grams of protein and these were featured in somebody's video. And then I happened to have the coupon. Then I got the, I don't know how to say this correctly, LaCroix um, sodas. I guess you could call them it's sparkling water. Um, but I want to try mixing my greens to the superfoods with this because I saw a girl I follow on Instagram do that. So I'm going to try that out and she used the passion fruit flavor. I ran out of room over here so that's why it's like over on my <laughs> oven stove. Um, then I just got a regular white bread for the kids lunches, to, uh, market pantry, Target brand. Then I got this Bolt House Avocado Green Goddess. I heard this is amazing and it's, you know, it's, that it's healthy but it's a lot less fattening of a dressing and then I got light ranch for a recipe that I'm making tonight and I will vlog that then I got red hot wing sauce as well for a re the recipe tonight then I picked up two of these just for lunches for myself the rice cauliflower and the savory herb this is super super good it might not look it but it is so good and it's packed with flavor and it's uh, good for you then I got multi-grain English muffins so that I can make myself like breakfast sandwiches in the morning. I also got a bunch of bananas because I like to make oatmeal and slice up bananas on it. And the kids devour bananas as well, especially Raylan. And then I just got ketchup, uh, Target brand, apple juice, Target brand for the kids, hot dogs for those quick dinners that I have to do. Um, then I got a low-fat... Um, Cream cheese, again, for the meal tonight. I got turkey bacon that I can use for my breakfast sandwiches in the morning. And then I got egg whites. I probably wouldn't use egg whites for my breakfast sandwich. I would probably use, like, maybe one white egg white and then one egg with the yolk. Um, but these would be, like, if I want to sc uh, scramble up eggs with um, some spinach. And then I got three of these. They're like so cheap. They're like two bucks at Target. Um, and these are super, super good for you. 90% lean, only 10% fat. So I got three of these, um, two of them just for myself for lunches. And one I need it for a recipe that I'm making. Then I just got a bunch of apples, an onion for one of my recipes. And then I got two sharp cheddar cheeses uh, also for a recipe. And then we like to keep string cheese in the house. The kids love it and it's you know a decent snack it's better than grabbing a bag of chips and i got the light so that i could also have these and not kind of go over with my calories that day um and then i just got myself a garden salad also for a lunch um and i would put this bolt house vinegar vinegar this bolt house dressing um on my salad and then i got baby spinach for uh if i make eggs in the morning with my egg whites and of course eggs and milk and I've just been getting 1% uh, I haven't been getting almond milk because I really find myself not drinking it I just can't drink it but I'll be honest I don't really drink milk anyway like to begin with so um, but I did go from 2% down to 1% okay now this side a lot less um, this side is the non-refrigerated items so I got a bag of pretzels because I'm making this thing I saw on Facebook where you bake pretzels in the oven with this Italian dressing or uh, the powder and oil and you bake them for like an hour on 200 degrees so I want to try it as a little snack just to have in the house I'll if I do it today I'll probably vlog that um, then I got these again for the recipe that I'm making tonight I got this again for the recipe I'm making tonight um, like I needed this for recipe I'm making on Thursday. I need a rice for a recipe I'm making on Thursday. I thought I would try these. Uh, the kids eat these. I don't eat these. But um, the limited edition and sugar cookies are banging. So I figured the kids might like these. We'll give them a try. Uh, then I just needed tomatoes, tomato sauces. I needed some different um, 
soups again for meals I'm doing this week. This one, the corn is for the meal I'm doing tonight. Then I needed beef broth, chicken broth, and I stocked up on four Chef Boyardee's right for Wright and Ellie eats them too. But they like the only like the ABCs, one, two, threes with the meatballs. They will not eat any other Chef Boyardee. I don't know why. Um, but they're just good to have. They're a dollar, so I got four. And then I did have to go to Aldi's to get chicken because Target let me down and they were out of chicken breast and I needed like four pounds of chicken breast for my recipes this week. So I went to Aldi's, which was cheaper anyway. And for a real small and short um, Christmas decor haul, I didn't get too much Christmas decor yet because I want to decorate and see like where I really need to like buy things. Um, so... For now, I just picked up two pillows because I don't, I didn't have these, and I knew that I would want pillows because right now I have a Thanksgiving slash Halloween pillows out, so I'm gonna want to replace them with Christmas ones. So I picked up those, and then I needed a little plaque thing to replace a pumpkin plaque that I have. Um, it's like on a stand, not on the wall. So I picked this up to replace that, and then I also needed a table runner. We recently got a new table. Uh, we didn't have this table last Christmas, so I didn't. I don't have a table runner from last Christmas, so I just got this one. It opens up pretty long, so I'll fold it right now. Um, so I'm going to put this on the table for the holiday season. And I also picked up these beauty bands by Tone It Up. I love Tone It Up. And I just wanted to pick these up to kind of be able to use these for, you know, doing squats. Um, this exercise right here as well. All kinds of things. Um, they're so beneficial, and Tone It Up, they they have all their products, even like their protein bars and stuff and protein at Target, if you didn't know that. And their booty bands are so much cheaper than the other brands at Target. Or even ones that you can find online. They were only $10 and other ones are like $20. So I was like, yeah, I had a, I had $15 in gift cards there um, that I earned just from shopping. So I was like, might as well. Nothing to look at today, but this is okay. So I'm not gonna try this stuff on. It's a clothing haul, clearly. But I will insert pictures of the models wearing each item. I'm not gonna try it on because I don't have like a mirror to like show you. Like I'd rather do it where I'm in the mirror and I'm holding the camera because just it would be easier that way. Uh, and I'm not a model, so I don't really feel like modeling them at the moment. Um, but I'm going to show you what I ordered, how much my grand total was, the sizes that I got, and I'll tell you about the company too. This is not sponsored or promoted in any way. Feel free to sponsor me, Pink Lily, which is where this clothing is from. So the company's Pink Lily, Pink Lily Boutique, like I said, many of you probably have heard of it and if you have been with me for um, quite some time, then you will know. It's my favorite place to get clothing. And, like, ever since I shopped on this website, I can't get anything in stores anymore. Like, I'm just thoroughly disappointed in stores ever since Pink Lily because they are a little bit pricey, but when I tell you you get what you pay for, you get what you pay for. Like, it is so worth it. All the clothes that I've ordered from this website, I've had for years, um, you know, and they're all in great shape still. Like, it's just awesome. And their clothing is so flattering. Okay. So, like you know, if you've watched previous videos, um, me and Kevin are going to Kevin Hart in about less than two weeks. I'm so excited because I got him these tickets back in February for his birthday in August when like the tickets literally just got released for Kevin Hart and I was like on it. Got good seats, we're ready to rock and roll. But I needed an outfit and um, the, obviously the first place I went to was Pink Lily. 
So their website is pinklilyboutique.com or pinklily.com. I'll link their website below regardless. But first, I want to show you the jeans that I got. Again, I will insert images over here of the model wearing these clothing. So these are the, I forget what they're called, these jeans specifically. Um, I forget what they're called, they have like a name. So I got a size seven and I have jeans from them already, but the jeans that I have went by small, medium, and large and I got a size medium and I believe medium was like a five seven. So I just went up a size to a size seven. I am trying to lose weight, so I'm hoping these are like it looks like a smaller seven actually but so i'm hoping that we'll be all right but they're really really cute there's no rips in them all my jeans have rips in them so i wanted to get a pair that didn't have rips they're an awesome material they are stretchy i don't like jeans that are stiff they're just uncomfortable so i will include the price of these the model the name of them everything in this clip so this is what i'm wearing to kevin hart it's this really pretty it's like a tighter fitting dress and it's it's like probably i think it comes like right above the knee yeah it's like right above the knee long sleeve it's a really nice heavy but comfy material and i am going to be wearing this with this scarf so this is a blanket scarf like so it's literally a big square and you would put it on like a scarf here let me see if i can I don't even know how to do this. I've never had a blanket scarf before. Oh, it's so I don't know. Oh my gosh, I'm not doing this right. All right, you know what? We're just gonna link the picture and I'll figure that out later. But I'm basically gonna be wearing this. This will be around my neck. And I ordered um, knee-high boots. Now, Pink Lily has the knee-high boots for like, 45 I think but I found them on JC Penny actually for $31 with a coupon so and actually I would have ordered mine off Pink Lily with this order so it was just easier but they were actually out of stock so then I found them on JC Penny and I was like sweet they're even cheaper and then I just kind of got some oh 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 uh. and then one more thing to go with that outfit I'm gonna probably be hot in this outfit so then I got this cardigan that I'm also going to be wearing with the dress I'm holding it upside down so really cute it's really really long so I'll, I'll insert the picture it comes down past your knee and it's long sleeves and so i'm actually it's going to be this my my dress and this with the scarf and then my black boots so that's the outfit i'm wearing to kevin hart i'm super stoked about it and then I just got two shirts that I just had to have that I didn't have to buy, but I just wanted to. I mean, I really do need them. I'm just saying. But it's bad. Once you go on this website, you like want everything. Like, there's 20 more things I want to buy. Horrible. All right. This shirt, if you could feel this right now, it's one size fits all. It's a very like, it's literally like a really thick, amazing leggings material so it's just i don't know it's just wonderful it's really good to like tuck into pants so, like i wish you could feel this right now it's like amazing it's really really stretchy and i want to get a black one they have, they have like black um like a light maroon color or like a mauve and the navy blue i think they had white too they were out of the black and white though i really want to get the black and white because that goes with everything so i just wanted to kind of have this as like an essential necessity in my closet and the last thing the last shirt this big sweater that their instagram account sold me on but it's a really really big oversized sweater you can wear this off your shoulder i've seen the girls wearing them but it's really really big and when you tuck them in on the bottom into like jeans or something it's super cute like i'll show you the pictures that i've seen so I really wanted to have this, and I can also wear my blanket scarf with that too. I mean, that's probably gonna be nice and warm, but. And then I just had to get this cute little knit hat because it was cute. Hey, Ray. And I don't have a hat, so. 
It looks like this. I'll insert a picture again. <laughs> Hi, can I have a kiss? <laughs> I'll insert a picture of a girl wearing this, um, but it's super, super cute, and it's like a tighter fitting hat, and it's not too long. I don't like when they like flop off the back of your head, and it's got a little CC on it. I'm gonna be honest, I don't know what the heck that stands for. You guys are probably like, holy crap, her order was probably so expensive, right? Listen to this. My order was 236, somewhere around there, dollars, okay? I went on Retail Me Not, found a coupon code and i don't know if, if you guys go and order i don't know if it's going to still be valid but go on retail me not or just google pink lily boutique coupons and i found a 15 percent off coupon which off 230 some dollars is a lot it was plb 15 so i did that and my total came to 203 dollars after tax and if you spend a hundred dollars or more you get free shipping so I feel like I made out like a bandit. I saved like almost $40. So pretty much I got one, one of these $40 items for free. And I'm super happy with my order. I do gotta go try everything on, but I do have to say that they're very true to their sizes. So if you know your size, there's a side chart, size chart on their website. If you are familiar with your size and your measurements and all that, you'll be good to go. I've never had to return anything to Pink Lily and I order from them at least three times a year. If I need a dress, Pink Lily is the first place I go to. They have awesome maxi dresses. They just came out with their holiday dress collection and I'm like in love, I'm dying. Like they have these super cute like long pant jumpsuits like and it's such an easy website to navigate through and their Instagram's awesome. Like it actually blows my mind that I was able to find such a good online clothing company. Because all right, that's all. <laughs>
Hello, you guys. I have a huge glare on my glasses. How am I going to fix this? Uh, that's kind of better. Now the lighting's really terrible. Um, anyway, I actually wasn't planning on vlogging at all today because I just had some things around the house to do and I've just been running here and there and I just really kind of really forgot this morning to even take off the camera. So I was like, yeah, I'll just vlog tomorrow and then close it up. But I'm going to just vlog today real quick and close it up because I'm a little disappointed in something that I purchased um, yesterday. And I think I vlogged it either on here or I vlogged it on my Instagram in my Instagram story. But either way, I know some of you saw it. So I just wanted to mention something pertaining to it. I had mentioned that I bought the Tone It Up booty bands, these, and that I heard they're great quality and you know, they were cheaper than the $20 ones and I'm all about cheaper. Don't do it, girl. I literally was so excited to work out today and use these booty bands and I've never used booty bands that ripped. Okay, I'm not a like huge person. I'm rather small and they ripped. And honestly, even on a larger person, these bands should never rip because they are made for working out. They are made for losing weight, you know? So um, I literally did one rep. Actually, I don't even think I did a rep. I actually like, I put them on and they rolled up immediately you know, into like a tourniquet pretty much. And I think I like did a squat maybe and they snapped and I was like, what the heck? And Raylan's like, uh oh, I'm like, yeah, uh oh. I was not happy. I was very upset um, because Tone It Up is like a really good company. Like I enjoy watching their videos and their exercise videos and following them on social media and so then when you go and buy one of their products and this happens so easily and so quickly, it kind of just makes you go, what is this now? Like, I'm sorry, what? So anyway, I did end up trying to use the blue band, but literally like I did a couple squats and a couple like reps of like opening and closing your legs. And I literally felt like it was going to snap the entire time that I was using it. And I was just more scared and fearful of that than I was focused on working out. So I just stopped and I'm going to go back to Target probably tomorrow after we drop Ellie off and return these because I'll take that $10 back and get better quality, the $20 better quality ones. Honestly, I might not get them at all because I do have this system here at my house that I bought a long time ago called the booty belt it's like black and hot pink some of you have probably seen it you have, you have to order it online you can't get it well you can get it, um like copycats of it in stores i've seen but i do have that which is actually probably better than these kind of bands anyway so i might just you know start doing that again instead of these but anyway moral of the story i did not want to share my hair is falling out of the clip i did not want to share a product product with you that i initially said was decent and good and then have this happen i had to update that product review because like i said my channel will always be true and honest sponsored or not sponsored because i don't want to like i would be so furiated if somebody told me something was on me i mean i've heard these are good but they could have been false reviews and i'm infuriated so <laughs> it was only ten dollars i know but i think it's just the whole fact of just getting some new workout equipment motivating me to work out and that happened i was just like forget it fixed my hair all right but i'm going to wrap up this vlog here thank you so much for watching this vlog thank you for watching all of my vlogs thank you for all of your support and just watching my videos and not getting bored of them or unsubscribing and i love your input as i'm playing with this broken band it's all it's good for now just kidding that was rude um just being honest, you know, keeping it real on the chan. All right, I'm gonna box this back up and get it ready to go back to Target tomorrow and um, go fold this laundry that I'm totally procrastinating on not folding right now. I'll see you guys in my next vlog next week. Bye.